Hi everyone, in this video we will see basic mates for assembly, and also add a custom camera view, for a car rolling over bumps. Let's start. Here I have assembled basic car, with simple body and suspension components. I have a base, with simple bumps pattern on it. Each side has an independent suspension system. The mates are such that wheel can move up and down. Now we will place the car on base. Here, I have created an offset plane, on the top surface of base, within the component. I'll mate the bottom surface of car body, with the offset plane, for positioning of car. Thus, we will have a fixed plane for car body to move. Now, we will make the base as fixed component. And adjust the wheels on it. We will use simple tangent mate to bring the wheels in contact with base. We will do it for all wheels. The car seems to be in the correct initial position. We will suppress the tangent mates of wheels, since we required it for initial positioning. We don't need it during motion study, as the wheels will be bouncing off the bumps. The base is fixed component. We will make car body as floating component, as it will move on base. Let's go to motion study. Select the basic motion option. Change some settings. Make frames per second as 160. Keep geometric accuracy and 3D contact resolution as high. Add contact between wheels and the base. Add gravity, check the required direction and value. The gravity in horizontal direction will provide acceleration for the car. Now, add linear spring between the two moving parts of suspension. Select the edges, and enter a stiffness value. Add a spring at each wheel. The springs will bring the required suspension effects in the motion study.
click on Calculate. Dragging the time key, to increase motion time. Let's check the motion in normal side view. The car speeds up, and the wheels bounce off the bumps. Now, we will add a custom camera. Make the camera type as floating. Select the surface of rear wheel as camera position. Rotate the camera as required. We will change the view type of camera. Make camera view as active view. Let's check the motion from camera view, at 0.25 speed. Let's check again. Hope this video was interesting and helpful. Thank you. Subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned for upcoming videos.